Village of Wellington's police department needs a new station. But a few local business owners were surprised to learn they may need to move out to make room for it. Being transparent, you know, and honest is probably a good way to do business. And this is just the opposite of that. They told News 5's Tara Molina today they heard about the potential move from a newspaper article. And they claim their landlord never gave them a heads up. At least one of these Wellington small business owners said this is already hurting business because of the confusion. So I talked to everyone involved and found out what's going on and why these people didn't get a heads up. So we were basically blindsided by the news. After eight years running her law office here. It's basically like getting your eviction notice from the paper. More than 24 in the city of Wellington, Alicia Vitica grew up here. Her clients are here. She has roots here, but told me she doesn't feel she was treated that way. We were not informed by the landlord or the village in any way at all. Yes, she and the accountant she shares this office space with found out the village made plans for a potential new police station here that would displace them and their businesses from a local paper. It's just disheartening to know that three core businesses in this building um, are being uh, tossed to the curb with nowhere to go. She's met with city officials since and told me they were under the impression their landlord gave them a heads up. They were misled and we were misled. Or they wouldn't have gone public with the purchase agreement, giving them exclusive rights. But why do you think it's a good idea to displace businesses that have been in your community for three or three decades? I took that question to Mayor Hans Schneider. And we're going to aid them and work with them to ensure that they stay here in this community. He explained the building has been for sale for years and is their best option, both financially and logistically. That building has been sale for a number of years and that uh, they were aware of it. They have acknowledged that they were aware of it. Plans and that purchase agreement have been made, but this isn't a done deal yet. Uh, right now we are focused on the election on November 6th. There will be an income tax increase on the ballot in November that would help pay for the new station they want to put here. So will the move and the new police station only happen if the levy passes? On November 7th, we're either going to be ecstatic and start to uh, move forward and develop our plans for that building, or we're going to sit down and make an evaluation on where we are on that day. So it may happen regardless? Um, I, possibly anything, I guess, could happen. Now, the mayor also said if they end up moving forward with this plan, he will make sure the city helps these folks with their relocation. I made several attempts to reach the owner of this building today, the landlord, who everyone says is behind this communication. I have not heard back from him. Reporting in Wellington, I'm Tara Molina, News 5.